I am making a... Uh, Frank. We call it Frank. I don't know why, but it's called Frank. It's uh, basically a vermouth spritzer. I'm using sweet or red vermouth. Um, now the key with vermouth, since it is a fortified wine, is to get, you know, keep a, as new a bottle as you can have on hand. And keep it chilled after and you And always, open it. once you open the bottle, keep it in the fridge. You could do this with um, white vermouth too, if you want. But this is red vermouth. This is, uh, I'm doing about an ounce and a half, right in the glass, filled with ice. And then I have some, this is champagne, but you can use any white sparkling wine. I wouldn't go would super like. sweet though, right? Because you're already getting a little sweet. No, use a dry, a dry. Sparkling. Sparkling wine. wine. A Prosecco would be nice. But a drier one. Right? But a dry one. This is uh, champagne. Happen to have around. And just pour that over the top. Now, just to get a little fancy, I've got some thyme right from our garden. I'm going to put right in there. I think thyme, you thyme know. Thyme goes fabulous with any citrus. Yeah, it's sort of giving it that. It's citrusy. Herby, right, uh, playing up the citrus thing. I have uh, totally not necessary, but I happen to have some orange bitters on hand. So John I'm gonna. John gets bitters as gifts from friends I love because bitters. they know how much he enjoys, you know, mixing cocktails and mixology and whatever. Put a little drip in there. So John has, jeez, I don't know, probably a dozen or more. Now here, bitters. I would not say this part is optional. I am taking a vegetable peeler, and just. Slicing a huge, that's a big chunk. Around this, I like it. It looks pretty in the drink. A big. And it gives it a lot of essential oils yeah. from the orange itself. Big piece of orange twist. Wow, that's a monster. It's going to make it really nice, I think. It's like one of those supersized trucks or something. <laughs> and then. Oh uh, my gosh, look what you did. What did I did? <laughs> John Ooh. took the peeler attachment from the drawer that turns it into... Like an octopus. Julienne. So John made a julienne of the orange. Whatever, that looks good. <laughs> I don't mind look, that. It looks great. Looks like an orange octopus. I'm going to put drink. a little bit more bubbly on top. It's gorgeous, honey, and it's very fragrant. And then you like a straw, right? So I do. I prefer that. Thank you. And I like straw. to stir it up a little bit. Mix yeah, you can just do a little stirry stir. Not too much because you don't want the bubbles to all go away. And there we have Frank, our buddy Frank. Happy anniversary. This is like anniversary. a Festivus because we're taping this a few days ahead. We, uh, here's to Italy. We'll be in Italy where we the scene of the crime. Where we oh, were where all the magic happens. Where we were married. Uh, cheers, honey. Cheers.